Oh boy, I have no idea how FSD is gonna fit through here. Hey guys, we're going shopping at the American Dream Mall in New Jersey. It's raining and there's quite a bit of traffic today. FSD makes a mistake towards the end of this video, but it performs some impressive maneuvers on the narrow streets of Jersey City. Let's dive in. We're starting in Jersey City and the weather isn't great. You'll see me occasionally pressing the windshield wiper button on my steering wheel because the auto wipers and Teslas aren't very effective. We have a moment here where a truck is blocking our lane. What makes things worse is that there are people walking in front of us and a vehicle blocking the lane on the left as well. FSD activates its left turn signal, likely to indicate it wants to squeeze into the gap, but it waits for an oncoming car to pass. There is another oncoming car and a few construction workers walking, so there's a lot going on. But it sees an opening and drives through. I personally think FSD got the timing correctly. The car behind me apparently gets frustrated from waiting and cuts in front of me. This is just your typical New Jersey driver. They have zero patience. The light turns green and FSD makes a left turn here and it immediately switches to the right lane to prepare for the upcoming right turn. For this traffic light, it's impressive how FSD can identify the green protected right turn light among the red lights. Also, you can see me struggling with the auto wipers here. For those familiar with my videos, cars on this street often make a left turn here. FSD wants to get around this car, so it activates its right turn signal. What's funny is that it couldn't find a safe opening and ends up going straight. We'll be driving straight for a while, so I'll talk about some Tesla news. The US Department of Transportation announced a new automated vehicle framework to boost self-driving car development. It aims to prioritize safety, cut regulatory red tape, and create a single national standard to replace varied state laws. This could speed up testing and deployment for companies like Tesla, helping the US compete with China in autonomous vehicle tech. It could benefit Tesla by streamlining approvals for its FSD technology nationwide. The car in front of me drives around what I think is a pothole. FSD mimics this behavior, though not as extreme. Maybe I'm just seeing things, but it's quite interesting. I wish that FSD could identify potholes, or there should be some way to report them to warn other Teslas. We have a pretty scary moment here. FSD makes a left turn onto this very narrow street, and I see a very tight gap between these two cars. I'm just wondering, how in the world can we fit through here? FSD is not afraid at all and goes through the tight gap with ease. Great job at not scratching my car, FSD. We have a moment here where we're lining up to get on the main highway here. It's not too exciting, but it's usually hard to squeeze onto the highway due to the number of cars. The cars aren't moving too fast, so FSD is able to find an opening. I made a video this week doing a review on a video Tesla released for their supervised robo-taxi experience for their employees in Austin and San Francisco. I took it down because the video is way too long, but I'll summarize some highlights. Before you summon a car, it's already on its way to you, which helps reduce wait time. Tesla is currently using a mix of new and legacy Model Ys. The new Ys rely on the rear screen to allow you to do things like adjust the temperature and play some music. For legacy Ys, I assume you'll be able to do the same things, but on your phone. The overall experience looks simplistic, and it should be smooth and snappy when it arrives to the general public in June in Austin. I'm using hurry mode today, so FSD is doing a lot of lane shuffling here. I'm using hurry mode because the map always shows the wrong speed limit here. It shows 40, but I think it's actually 50, so FSD tends to drive a lot slower compared to everyone else. I need to double check if the speed limit shown on my screen is correct or not. When it comes to the Tesla stock, there have been news here and there that helped us slowly climb up the past two weeks. I follow a few trading groups and many folks are expecting a rally soon. Joe Jebby is a Tesla board member and also the co-founder of Airbnb. He recently bought $1 million of Tesla stock. This is the first time an insider has purchased Tesla stock in the past five years. He even sold Airbnb shares to do this. This makes me wonder, what does Joe know? So we're almost at our destination. We're getting off the freeway and FSD needs to get to the far left lane to make an immediate left turn. We slowly approach the left-hand side. 
But the funny thing is that it doesn't even make it and tries making the left turn using the second lane from the left. Based on the arrows on the ground, that doesn't seem correct. Based on my pin, I believe we're supposed to go straight, but FSD decides to go into the left turn lane. I disengage here. Maybe I placed the pin incorrectly, but regardless, I need to go straight. We just arrived at the American Dream Mall. They have the new Model Y and Quicksilver here for the public. It's a pretty futuristic looking vehicle. If you guys are in the area, check it out. Anyways, I'm signing off.